So. <clears throat> Island is feudal. And we are waging war against our own vassal. Down here. Because I think he was doing things we didn't like. There are titles that might be created. We hold too many holdings. Uh, one of which is a city, so we will just turn that around. And another one is a city, so we'll turn that out as well. So there should be another... Nope. Not another city. Let's see, what else do we hold? What do we hold? <clears throat> if you hold down CTRL and left click, you get a view of the direct vessels of a realm. And we hold this. Which... Honestly, we don't want to hold. What does this belong to? No, what do you belong to? This. Do we own this? No, our heir does. Right, I remember! We wanted to give those titles around, but the council wasn't all that happy. Can we give this away to someone? I mean, it's actually not bad. Let's check our other holdings. Ah, they are not better, so honestly, I'd rather give up something over here than this. This is better. And we're going to do something else. We're going to build ourselves a castle, so... We're going to give up both these holdings so we can have a second castle down here. I think two castles in the same county is very, very strong because you never lose your core uh, your, your core county. That's something that is yours. And uh, yeah, so this is really strong, which we're going to do, which we also saved up for. And also we're going to go ahead and upgrade everything we can. Castle Town for some more money. Yes, please. So now... One of the major in, uh, changes here is money versus prestige. Now let's check who who could we give some of this. We're probably also giving up the duchy up here. Who cares to have this? Hey man, can I give you another title? Can I give you this? Not the duchy of Uluaid. The county of... That is this. Right, let's include the lower titles. He gets that. Who does this belong to? This. Alright. We have someone in court who could be put up to this. My kinsman, who's a not so great commander. Let's give him this. No. Um. Will you let me give this away to this man? Apparently yes. But he's a really good commander so I'd rather not give it to him. Can I give it to this man? Yes. Apparently my court is not very happy with me wanting to give stuff to my own lineage so right now we just need to get rid of things he's going to be our new count up there as well our new duke uh well he's not apparently gonna make him the new duke no well we've taken care of our holding situation Let's take care of all the other situations. This guy, Anglo-Saxon. Powerful vassal. Do we have any other powerful vassals? That I do not know of. Who are you even? Oh, you're the Duke of Mercia. Apparently there has been some succession going on. Right, we are uncrowned. We need to organize a ceremony, but for that we need to be at peace. To get ourselves some leg legitimacy for our rule. Now, 
You might think, but going feudal is silly. Because, yeah it is, now we can't raid anymore. Which takes away some of our income. But, you know, they're still tributaries. We are quite threatening, so... People will be in defensive packs, and I'm pretty sure there is a defensive pact, yeah. There's someone that called the monster in a defensive pact against us. I feel betrayed a little bit. So... How is Glyswick, East Anglia, Gwent? Uh, these guys... These guys, I think, aren't in here. Oh no, they are. They are in. But I don't think these guys are in. Nope. Right, how many how many troops can we field? Well, we currently have a certain amount of troops, which is not necessarily representative of what we actually can have. We have 900 retinues, which we also need to check up on because now they don't cost us any... Hello. Okay. We'll have to unpause and see, have a few things update because this isn't very representative of things. All right, people don't like us all too much. What's his beef? I'm a tyrant. Which gives minus 450. Are you joking? I ask, art thou joking? It's minus 10 on others. Okay, then. I guess Mr. Grumpy Pants. Did I give Mr. Grumpy Pants not a job on my council? Oh yeah, he's my advisor. I probably should have put him into somewhere where I can kill him. Oh well. What can you do? Uh, let's have our diplomat improve relationships with the guy who has a minus 450 of us. Now we can collect taxes. But our... Councillors do has also changed, so we shall do that. The military technology spread rate doesn't really do much, I don't think. We need to go convert some infidels around here. Round piece is enforced. We have the wrong type of holding in places. How do we have a bishop back there? Ooh, what the hell is this? Oh, we have this tiny little island, which I didn't notice is an actual thing in itself. Right, so we gave away way too many holdings for no good reason whatsoever. That's not great. So we raised a few new vassals for ourselves, and we're going to keep this because it's not too terrible as well, either. Oh, well. Okay, all right. All right, all right, all right. Okay, let's see. We might raise our vassal levies. Now, we're much less powerful as it is right now. And we have a dangerous faction, which is pretty big. These people have a lot of uh, power compared to me. They have basically exactly the same amount of troops I have. Um, so the only good way, or the only two good ways to get rid of this particular claim is by either killing the claimant they're trying to support here, or sending out a few gifts. Let's send out a few gifts, win a few hearts for cheap. Because people might stop doing their thing. Alright, the Mercia guy we need to break up. That That's not gonna work out.
Can't really revoke his uh, title, sadly. So let's go to war a bit. First we kill his troops. Ah, uh, now we don't need no merchants right now. Alright, our unit composition has changed as well. So we have a decent amount of light and heavy infantry mixed. So, with enough troops and decent commanders, we should be well equipped to deal with any tribes that might come around. Alright. Dangerous faction is winning support. Sadly, how's our plot power over here? We have a 0% plot power. That's not great. So we are looking at a rebellion here. Since we are, let's check our pacts. And it's not looking good either. We need to get some uh, tributary. Quick. Before our vassals become troublesome. Right, I'm hungry. Children are being born. I have the peace here. Well done. Sand down our troops. Get our retinues back home. Check on... Retinues still cost us prestige, which is good. Because if they were costing us gold, as they do for few little... We wouldn't be really able to afford them all that well. Because our income is quite low right now. This is mainly due to having armies raised for a second. But now we shall go get ourselves some tributaries out here. Chiefdom of Lylin. You're my vassal, you can't join them. Are you kidding? Is there anyone better suited for this? No, you have less troops. Oh, you. We have quite a few men. Let's declare... Declore. <laughs> Let's extort some tribute here. We really need to make sure that we are well prepared for this. So now, also different, as I said, we, de we do control all our vassal levies directly. No more allies walking around. Being told what to do. So we need to catch all our troops, pull them together, and then begin fighting. We need to be a little bit careful because we are moving troops right next to him. Oh, we can imprison someone. Or something. Jesus. Alright, things are not looking great. In certain places. Are we going to attack immediately? Right, people are plotting against us. Yes, this is no surprise. People hate having their troops raised. The Valdesian heresy has appeared in our kingdom. Clearly a terrible thing. Right, and we took a battle that I really didn't want to take, but we're still winning it. At least, well, I wanted to take the battle, but not 
in the on these terms really. <laughs> Wasn't exactly what I was going for. All right, we've improved our relationships with this man by a whole 40. That's going to eat away slowly but surely on the 450. Now he's fighting East Anglia or something. Need to have them be tributaries quick, quick, quick. Someone usurped the title from someone. We're in love with our wife or lover. I didn't read. Too long, didn't read. All right. The marshal needs to be replaced. We're not going to put our best men on this. We're going to put someone who is nice to us. I like this, who supports us. We shall go train troops at home. And we don't have a designated region anymore. Let's have it our wife. Why not? So he's sieging some stuff from me. But we should be done with all of this before he finishes. So there we go. Got some decent prestige out of it. And more importantly, More importantly, we got a new tributary out of it. And we shall actually continue on our quest for unwilling allies. After we have ourselves a coronation ceremony. And we don't have the greatest relationship with the Pope. We can ask him to crown us, but he's probably going to demand some weird stuff, so we shall honestly not even ask him. He's probably going to demand some sort of relic be handed over to him, which I don't appreciate. Now currently, and for a long while longer, the greatest threat that we're going to face are our own vessels. So we need to switch our focus on them, improving relationships with them. And what I'm doing is probably not the cleverest thing. I should look for these people, like her for example, and sway her instead of the guy who has minus 450, where nothing is going to happen. We need to have a good relationship with family. We're going to put him actually on talking to her. So she stops supporting stuff. No more factions fighting against me. All right. Anglesi. Right, so... For a coronation ceremony, he's like, Okay, give me this, give, give me this county. Then I'll crown you. Uh, no. Probably going to be crowned by a priest, which isn't as prestigious and it's not going to work as well. All right, okay. He would like <clears throat> better accommodations in my prison. He can be goddamn glad he even exists. Um, now, he goes into the oubliette, which is a very, very small room. Something that you can barely stand in. And nothing else which will lower his chances of survival. Oh, look at him. He's not bad. Just came to our court. Okay, we're at the point in the game where really I'm not going to talk about every single decision I make, where I don't talk about every single window I click away because we're really kind of beyond that. Who are you fighting? Holy War for Poes. So you're fighting him. 
And you're probably also winning. But don't. Duke Withred the Just. Oh yeah. No wonder. Okay, I can I can give his vassals duchy titles. Can do that. So if I went ahead and created one of these or two of these, I could create the Kingdom of England. We don't want that because we're not near enough on creating an empire. So if we had the kingdom title for England, we would splinter our holdings. So we're not going to create that. Let's see how much? One hundred gold. It's these holdings. Two of which belong to one guy. So we could take this from him. I believe. So. There's two belonging to her. Okay, we can take a little bit of his vassals away. Let's create the Duchy of Lancaster. And grant it to this guy. Which, of course, the council won't like. Damn you, council. Why do you hate me so? I should really replace these people with the S-men. We need people who... Who support us, not people who do the right thing right now. Which might be harder than I thought, because there's nobody really convinced with us. Oh great, so now I have the Stachy title I can't do anything with. Ha ha ha, boy. I could give it to him. Because the succession is going to split it up once he dies. He's going to lose it. Plus, he's going to like us a little bit more. Let's give him... The Duchy of Lancaster. He likes that, of course he does. Can have that, no worries. Going to splinter him. Fine by us. There you go. Well... No, we're not going to send her 100 gold to... Get her more on our side. We're going to tell her of our prosperous realm, which really isn't all that prosperous, but she still thinks she she hears some merit in what we say. Alright, so this is on the construction and it will be done soon actually. 14th of October. And the first things we really want to push is always the castle town. Another Great point in having everything in the same in the same in the same thing. <laughs> wow! All your holdings in the same county. There we go. Is that the technology level applies to everything? So that's nice. Something to keep in mind. Let's check our vassals. God, oh, they really don't like us, do they? Maybe we can have a few non-aggression pacts while we're at it. No. Don't need them with them. Nope. Nothing good to be done here. Nothing at all. But offer to join a war. What are you fighting for? Are okay, you fighting for some holding with the Picts? Which I do appreciate. Because the Picts, as I said, are a little bit of a threat. Now let's see if we can't get a good coronation this time. 